What's going on YouTube? I'm Sam with Sword of Exotics. On this episode of How Much Should You Pay, we're going to be going over how much you should be paying for a pancake tortoise. Stay tuned. Okay, so to kick things off, you need to watch my previous video that's gonna kinda go over how, how we're gonna be going through the different variants and prices when it comes to these animals. And I'll leave a link for that above and as well as in the description below. And it kinda goes over basically the main aspects of what's gonna differentiate with the prices of these animals. But to kick it off for now, we are first gonna go over how readily available these animals are. They are pretty common in the hobby. They're not super, super easy to find. Like you can go to any pet store and find them, but they're pretty easy to find through journal breeders, or you can even go to reptile shops and shows and find them as well. So with that, it is important to keep in mind that these animals are critically endangered in the wild and they are now a CITES Appendix 1 or whatever it's called, meaning that they cannot be illegally imported and sold into the hobby. Well, what does that mean? It's actually a good thing because that means you can only get these animals captive bred uh, and there's plenty of them within the hobby already. So that won't make it more difficult to find. However, that may adjust the price a little because a lot of the adult generations out there were wild caught animals. With that being said, first I will be going over how much you should be paying for a hatchling pancake tortoise. Now I got gloves on because I just like to keep gloves on when I'm touching different animals and everything just so I don't cross contaminate. But Keep in mind, this price may fluctuate a little bit higher, but I would say for a baby pancake tortoise, I would pay probably about $400 up to $500 for a hatchling. And I'm talking like probably under six months old. Uh, I've seen, uh, there's this one, I'm not gonna bash out people, but I saw at a reptile show, these people had a hatchling pancake tortoise for $600. And then a couple months later at the same reptile show, they had the same exact one for the same price. And that, that's just kind of a rip off in my mind. And I understand, like I said, in all my videos, like everyone has their ways that they need to make money. Some people do this for a complete living, but you can get animals at a way better price as well as probably possibly even better looking animals. So for a hatchling pancake tortoise, we're going to shoot in the 400 to probably five to maybe 550 range. It could go up there a little bit more with the CITES 1 appendix now happening. Now we're going to move on to more of the yearling phase. This is a, I believe he's about 14 months old. So he's a little bit older. He's well established. Um, with that being said, an animal that's a little bit more well off, I would easily probably pay around 550 to probably 750. Um, like I said before, I got I got both of the my animals a little bit before this whole CITES things happened, so they were a little bit on the cheaper side. But expect that price to move up, so maybe more towards the 700 range for an animal that's already been well established for a couple of years and whatnot. Now, something that actually makes these tortoises honestly probably one of my favorite ones in the world is one they're actually called the pancake tortoise because they're flat. If you can look here, and two, these are one of the as far as I believe, they're probably the only species that doesn't actually hide in its shell from predators. They will actually run from predators and wedge themselves in between rocks. And if you look here, they actually have a little bit of a soft shell. And what they'll do is they'll inflate their bodies so animals cannot pull them out of their crevices that they're hiding on, which is a really, really cool adaptation in my opinion. Now, when we're talking adult pancake tortoises, obviously females are gonna be on the higher end. Um, I mentioned this in the previous video that Females will always be more expensive for reasons that you just gotta watch the first video for. So, when it comes to an adult, I would say for a single individual, anywhere between a thousand, actually, no, let's go maybe 950 to about 1200 per individual. Uh, if you do enough scoping around, you can find something on the better end deals. But like I mentioned before, those late or early generations of pancake tortoises that are adults, a lot of those were wild caught animals. So you gotta keep in mind that there could be parasites, they could not be thriving in captivity, all this whatnot. Wild animals are always gonna be cheaper than captive bred because they're, they're just not well established as well as a captive bred animal can be. So keep that in mind. So with that, an adult pancake tortoise, probably about nine, 950 to a 1200 range is the general area. 
But again, in coming years when all these younger ones are going to be older and captive bred, that price may go up because getting wild caught ones isn't going to be much of a thing as much anymore. But the cool thing with these tortoises is they're just very, very unique animals and I'm very proud to say that I own one of these. They are very intelligent. They're not the most lucrative display animal because they do tend to hide a lot, but nonetheless they are awesome and easily one of my favorite species. So. The whole plan, obviously, I would mention in previous videos that we're going to try doing one of these probably like every Wednesday or Thursday. That's not going to happen. I don't get paid to make YouTube videos yet. Hopefully, maybe one day, but we'll see. So until then, I'm just going to keep probably doing this on a Sunday basis and try to film in some other content there. But eventually down the line, if I could make this a full-time thing, then I will definitely be posting more videos um, frequently throughout the week. So... Thank you for watching and please hit that subscribe button and we'll see you next week.